The Whiskey Brothers podcast is intended for an adult listening audience. If you find yourself easily offended, I guarantee this will do it. They don't want no problem. Nah. From Houston, Texas. The Whiskey Brothers podcast starts now. Uh, welcome to welcome. episode 900. <laughs> Welcome to episode 947. Uh, the <laughs> dais is here. Jerry Wayne Longmar, Trey Tutson, Sam Damaris, Sladeham, uh, across the table in a uh, in an awkward seat, as you would have it. Ian Dartes, uh, our good friend, uh, formerly of Hold On Hollywood, now a solo artist. And uh, what is what's going on in your world, dude? You're uh, are you wh- what are you doing? You just disappeared and now you're back. Right, and I disappeared again. Okay, I, <laughs> so I'm rebranding right now. Mm-hmm. I uh, DMT, huh? Right. Okay. Starting over. Got it. I uh, had a dream. I woke up and I was still alive. <laughs> there you go. Oh, oh, so that's a good dream. Yeah. You got some so. nice ass teeth. Thank you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so do you. No. <laughs> These are terrible teeth. Yeah. Yo, th- you Is got it? teeth I dream about having. Yeah. <laughs> it's a uh. teeth off. You went from uh, <laughs> y'all going teeth off. That's what we brought you here for. It's it's, uh, it's like arm wrestling, but it's gonna get weird. Oh. Um, <laughs> I hope you're not here for the long haul. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you're not racist. <laughs> So, that's all we can really do with anybody, right? <laughs> just hope. You uh, so 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 the new stuff, your old stuff, it, it's rock and roll, right? You you, right. you 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 guys open for Bon Jovi, you've played Buzzfest, you're no slouch. You're Houston, you're Houston rock and roll royalty, and now you've stepped over. What is the new stuff? Is it rock? Is it R and B? Is it is it everything? Soul? Actually, is it all of it? How do you describe it? So whenever I first started my solo stuff, it was like a R and B hip hop kind of mix with uh, a little bit of the like earlier 2000s rock mm-hmm. like some guitar loops and stuff Hip like that pop smooth out right. on the r&b tip right so yeah. <laughs> you were not born when that so song no, came out i just no. feel stupid now wrong you got the wrong guy <laughs> but uh i just wanted to rebrand and do something that i know that i'm good at very cool you know like i'm gonna incorporate all those elements and now i'm gonna I don't want, don't want to give it away, but I got you. it's going to be more of on the rock side, but uh-huh. with those elements in it. Very cool. So imagine cool. Travis Barker would do a collab with someone who can actually sing. <laughs> <laughs> no. I just got to stop for a second. It's, it's, I, got a, I got a tattooed white dude that's got a thicker chain. Then the hood-ass black dude right next to him. Hey, bro, I don't oh, discriminate. Yeah, machine gun sweaty over here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to write that down. That's going to be my username now. <laughs> username. <laughs> bro, when I, did, when I did Roast Battle, Jeff Ross called me Blob Marley, and I was like, oh, my God. Wow. I was That's like, genius. I want that. And I went to Instagram, and some stupid-ass white girl has the fucking name oh, Blob right. Marley. And I was like, ah, fuck. Get culturally appropriating shit. Right. And that she's is skinny. <laughs> uh, I gonna, I, my next question is: Is she your type? <laughs> <laughs> and she's not. So. <laughs> uh, yeah, she looks like she's 14, 15 years 14, old. 15, and I was like, I want that. I wanted to just DM her because I'm like, if you're that young, here's a hundred bucks. Let me go with a fucking name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Start with twenty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So you're uh, the mu- the music's going well. What's uh, what's up on the personal side? How's how's your personal life? Is everything great? I uh, still alive. No, that's <laughs> great. He drug a girl to some no, dude's house right, so he can right, play right, guitar right. for her. <laughs> <laughs> like it's going well. <laughs> Jeez, you really are in high school. Yeah, yeah. Machine gun sweaty. That's she here because y'all like each other, or is she here because you've been fucking up? No, <laughs> she's stupid. Is she with me? <laughs> Don't we all say that? <laughs> right. <laughs> Whenever you're with somebody, you just look at them and you're just like, what are you thinking? Like, yeah. If you knew who I really was. Yeah. You believe in me? You dumb. <laughs> yes, I don't believe in me. <laughs> like, no. That's rock and roll, though. That's that's the uh, is live music. Live music is always, we always think about it, right? Like it's the same as comedy. We always, yeah, people yeah. get into it for the initially, oh, this is going to get me all the women. And then. You ha- you don't. have to c- it do-, do do what it don't it doesn't at all no no it, it doesn't it makes you it think you can and then <laughs> you can't yeah it doesn't but it gets you it gets you addicted to doing it. it's like it's like yeah I was like dude I'm gonna do comedy I'm gonna get all these girls and I'm gonna have all this money there was no girls there was no money and I was like well I'll just quit comedy I was like I'm not doing that this is too much fun and right. so I stayed broke and lived in my mama's house for a long time 
I mean, I've been there. Yeah. It's, it's I still totally live at my mama's house. No. <laughs> there's a, well, there's there's something there's something all I romantic about it where you're like, oh, this is this is great. I'm gonna get into this and all these. W- and then once they realize what it is you do, it's like, oh yeah, that's not what you wanted at all. I that's you, that's you, well, you. I think the narrative changed. You know, in the '80s, it was like, oh, you're signed. You're a musician. You know, mm-hmm. I want to be with you type thing. Now it's like you don't have any money. Right. So, <laughs> you know, yeah. well, everybody's a musician now. That was there was a point. I think there was a point <coughs> like back in the 80s or 90s. If you were a musician, you were a musician. Now you're just if you have a YouTube channel, you're a musician. Right. So it becomes a very it's a, it's a different environment. now. Motherfuckers it's making beats from their iPhone and shit. Yeah. And it's same thing with comedy. Mm-hmm. I mean, look at how many YouTube stars you see headlining comedy clubs right now I'm like what does he do for an hour yup <laughs> that no i mean that's 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 do the, you that's show videos of you sitting in your car at the mall yelling at people <laughs> i've seen people do it i've seen people do no, it I, i'm not gonna say a powerpoint and like this me this i remember my video right there i can't you know, remember the, i can't remember the guy's name uh <laughs> I'm, i'd mess it up if i even tried in like 2008 ish this is the old improv before it moved to the new location I'm about to hit you with his name because I think I was at the show with you. Go on. Hang on. It's gonna. Is it French? Jean Le Joie. Le Joie. Jean Le Joie. Jean Le Joie. That's the guy. Uh, I'm opening for him. He's a YouTube star. Uh, he no. Uh, no you no, you don't ahead, it's Trey. No. Whatever's ahead. in your head. Li- I don't have nothing listen, in my but head. But you do. You do. That was a funny sentence. <laughs> I wasn't chastising you for laughing. I was agreeing oh, okay, with you okay. and just simply saying that your laugh is an understated laugh. You don't even know. How it, because YouTube stars make videos that take weeks, right? And editing, and pr- you know, you know the yeah. process of videos, and then they <coughs> put them out there, and then they show up at a show, and there's this expectation that they're going to do all of that in the course of 45 minutes, mm. which all of that took years and sets and directors and costume changes and this and that. So I was there. I've been very fortunate in that um, I've been able to open for people who shouldn't be on comedy stages. <laughs> very early in their um, transition to the comedy stage. So I remember Piff the Magic Dragon when he came off of America's Got Talent. And didn't I he have the little child? Uh, wait, which one? The little girl who was like 12 oh, years uh, old. Oh, yeah, Safi. Safi, too. Um, there were there were so many of these that just, I was like opening for them on their first time doing a main comedy club stage. Nice. So it's really lopsided. Did you like, tell even Pivot? It was pivot, <laughs> pivot, <laughs> <laughs> and Piff Piff was great. Le, jo- Le Joie tried to do. He hadn't figured out that he couldn't do all the <coughs> the things he wanted to do yet. He, so he, he was sang so songs, trying. and they were very funny. Sang songs, but he also would run back into the green room and come back out two minutes later, just like a pine cone. And you're like, this what? is not. <laughs> yeah, whatever he was wearing in the YouTube video that that went viral, oh my he, he would s- every time he 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 sang a song. He would change into that. So he's doing his show and just leaves an empty stage. Yeah. I'll be right back. back I'll be right back. And then the music yeah, yeah. will fade are out you, and the crowd's are, like, are you really <laughs> excited about rebranding yourself? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. You got a uh, pine cone costume? No. <laughs> pine, I got a pineapple costume. Pineapple costume. And then that he, means something different. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> and then the fucker had the balls to, in between songs, he came out and was like, Yeah, I mean, I know you guys are probably coming out expecting to see stand up comedy, but I don't. Do that bullshit and blah blah, blah, blah. And like he shit on stand up comedy on the Houston Improv stage. And it's like, then why don't you take your fucking bitch ass to Verizon? Then how about you get the fuck out of my club? Oh yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't sell that place. You're up. right. Uh, yeah, you don't do comedy. We don't leave two minutes of fucking silence in front of a paid crowd. That's God, what that we such don't a do. Train wreck. I have a outfit underneath the outfit. That'd have been funny. Just That's rip it off on yeah, stage. If you, at least right. one quick change or something. There's a hundred different ways to do that well so here's the, the one here's the one that you didn't do um <laughs> the, the, i don't know if you remember there was one season of last, last comic standing where a guy made it on the show his name was mel silverback oh yeah and he was a fucking gorilla um <laughs> and he was just in a no. straight gorilla costume mm. doing gorilla puns it was actually very funny it's a gorilla in a tux and it was actually really funny it's jewish um, gorilla puns yeah here's the thing <laughs> The guy is an actual cop. Am I allowed Wait, to say that? What's the, I don't know. Uh, yes, as long as, yeah, yeah. Me. <laughs> as long as you clarify the difference between a regular gorilla pun and a Jewish gorilla pun. Well, it sounds like you offended two different races. <laughs> no, you know what it is? It's the difference between Silverback and Silverstein. Yeah, That's yeah. the. Uh, That's a, I just remember there was a uh, there was a I'll spin. Did you ever see back in the day, Mister Methane? That dude came to the laugh stop. The guy that did the fart tricks. 
Mr. No, Methane, no. he had a green bodysuit with a grommet around his butthole. You can't. <laughs> <laughs> and he would fart powder, blow powder out of his ass and stuff. Y'all don't remember Mr. Methane? He was a British. No. no. He traveled you, clubs all over the country in like the 80s and early 90s. Sounds like your ex what the fuck it sounds like. <laughs> blowing powder out of his ass. Jay Wayne, I got an eight ball for you. Uh, I just got to stand toot. over there with a Ziploc and catch it. <laughs> 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 That's the trick. <laughs> Hey, you shorted me. (laughs) Tastes like grommet. (laughs) (laughs) But Mel Silverback was an actual fucking comic. And the guy auditioned for Last Comic Standing as himself. And they were like, no thank you. So he left, went to the car, put on the gorilla suit, got back in line, and they were like, we love it. (laughs) This is incredible. This is groundbreaking comedy. The documentary is the walk back to the car. (laughs) (laughs) This is what I gotta be. It's like Dan Whitney when he decided to put on the fucking flannel shirt. But listen to what he did. Listen to this. So this is what he fucking does. He, he, He can't, this gorilla suit is hot, right? So I get booked to work with Mel Silverback. And I was like, I'm opening for a fucking gorilla. This is where, <laughs> my, this is where my life is. They go, no, 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 no. You're featuring. The gorilla is opening. And I was like, what? The guy you can't got- do 45 minutes in the fucking costume. Yeah. So the show is Mel Silverback Presents. The gorilla comes out, welcomes the crowd, does all these fucking gorilla puns, and goes, eh, coming to the stage now, Sam Damaris. And he leaves... The guy takes off the gorilla suit, fucking chugs a bunch of water, tries to get himself, like, get his body heat back down <laughs> while I'm on stage doing 20, and then I bring up the actual comic. And the crowd has no idea that this is the same fucking guy who was just the gorilla. And it was, so it was one of those things where it was like, it was like I, you're, you're hacking your way into these fucking stages, and, and this guy... He's legit getting headline work because it's like they want Mel Silverback. He's like, you don't get Mel Silverback if you don't get me to headline your fucking room. You only get as much of Silverback as I give you. Yes, I can do, <laughs> I can do 20 minutes in this suit and then I'm fucking out of it. And so he's going around legit headlining <laughs> these fucking clubs and got guys like me in the middle to where I was like, I really can't knock this shit. <laughs> like, this is fucking brilliant. That game is such a the, uh, entertainment sucks. That you got to dress up like a monkey to open for yourself I, I, and get yourself into I a room. I am absolutely exhausted trying to be a comic when I know that all I really got to do to get viral is show up at a park with some fucking milk crates. <laughs> <laughs> there, I'm wasting time oh, writing right. jokes. Did I miss this? I miss. I miss. I've been in. I've been in. Has been. Go ahead, buddy. I well, just I- enlighten me. I miss the whole thing. I just keep hearing milk crates, Bro. and I'm like, why is everybody breaking in and it's stealing my old roommate's Every couch? one of these videos should should begin with, hi, I'm Johnny Knoxville. Welcome to Black Ass. It's, it's, it is. Yeah. Wait, is it is it is it a black? It's some shit it y'all going to steal eventually. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's a black viral stunt? It's a yeah. black thing that wiped the king. Because who the fuck has that many yeah. milk crates? They're doing it over at Buffalo Bayou already. Bro. Home Depot selling milk crates. It's, oh, oh it's, it took over. So, so idiots you can't You haven't seen any of the videos? So you got to stack no. these shits up in numerical order reverse. Yeah. So you got to go one, two, makes three, four, five, triangle. six, and then it makes the fucking sh- And then you got to go. Two dimensional pyramid. Yeah. Yes. It's like American Nigga Warrior. So it's like you got <laughs> you to gotta go up, and then you got to try to go down. That's what the first video so was called. That's what the first video was called. So, um, <laughs> and then, and they don't make it. And I what I was telling people, man, the great challenge is actually a perfect representation of what it's like to root for somebody from the hood. <laughs> because you're like, he gonna make it. He gonna he didn't make it, fam. He didn't make it. <laughs> yep. Damn, he was almost there. Yep. <laughs> and then you go, I think I could do it. And then, oh, <laughs> oh, junior college. Oh, you didn't even go as far as he did. Yeah. You remember the Dark Knight Rises where he just keeps trying to crawl out of a cave? Oh yes. And just fucking falls and crack. It's that, but with black people, it is. And it, it's niggas and slides and shit. It's just hilarious. But there's two epic videos of people make it. One black girl does it in heels. In heels. And one dude Rose does it, it. while rolling, rolling a blunt. A joint. Bro, roll the black. Make it all the way to the I'm top. I'm gonna be honest with you. That's the easiest way to do it. Take, if you were doing if you were doing something else. <laughs> and you're you, not focused on Bro, it? listen to me. I used to tell people all the time, back in the day, I used to bartend at that martini bar uh in Houston. And people would always, we poured so many of these martinis, and they would be full to the brim. And people would always get up to go walk away with them, and they'd spill, stare spill, spill. at the glasses, and they'd shake. 
and I would just go, man, just look, don't even look at it. And if you don't look at it and you're look doing where so, you're walking. So as long as you're focused on making all these little micro adjustments, you fuck it up. If you d- so when you're up there, I bet those feet start doing that wobble and the oh thing God. starts shaking. This dude doesn't wobble at all. Well, it's a th- doesn't you- wobble at all. Only problem, his name is White Mike. Because like, he's light skinned. <laughs> That's why? He, yeah. He, dude, come on, man. You ain't had the one the one light skinned dude in the hood where everybody just like, what's up, white boy? You're right. Yeah, this is the only time he had rhythm. That's when he <laughs> <laughs> but, like, you got to go up it. And, I mean, they, they shake. It's not, it's not steady at all. And the top part is the, is the wobbliest part. It's the most unstable part. He gets to the top, and he's just <laughs> licks it, does it all the way. Then one step down, one step down, gets to the last, gets to the bottom crate, and I was like, I ain't getting off till somebody gives me a lighter. <laughs> he lights his fucking blood. Wow. And he gets over, and I was like, oh shit, oh shit, why Mike did that shit, oh shit. Yeah. And it's, it's, it's that makes me happier yeah. than black people excited on viral videos. Yeah. That is, oh. bro, if some fireworks yeah. go off, or if you make it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bootleg ass fireworks, bro. oh shit. That is but the sad shit is the environment around them. You're like, damn, this is all you niggas got. <laughs> Right. Uh, speaking of rhythm, <laughs> well, I did not before. Lying. Now I'm gonna take that. I'm not that. lying. But if you look, you're like, who? Who car is that? <laughs> <laughs> Shit! Yo, you can't get to work. What's the tallest? What's the tallest stack? Six. 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 <clears throat> one, two, three, four, five, six, five, four, three, two, one. But some of the falls from four are bad. Bro, that oh, doesn't seem God, that. That don't bad. seem that hard. Oh, yeah, so that gas station hat go fly. <laughs> I, I've been waiting for somebody to million dollar baby themselves on that channel. Dude, <laughs> they, 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 there's, a, there's a door, to, not the neck, but like, uh, remember Blood In, Blood Out when they put his back on that fire hydrant? There's oh. a guy who slips and his spine goes on stack three and his legs and head go the opposite Damn. direction. Uh, Hit, oh, they're, 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 they're brutal. The most tra- fucked oh. up part of all of it is TikTok has banned crate challenge videos yeah. because they just love fucking over black TikTokers. <laughs> <laughs> That's the truth. Oh, like, we going to have to they pay them? They it for injuries, we- but this nigga's getting shot <laughs> on TikTok. Literally, bang, bang. TikTok's so weird. You can shoot somebody, but if you say motherfucker too many times, they mute the video. They go, hey, no audio, but you can witness this murder. (laughs) 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 Yeah, the language is too bad for children, but they should know. Don't go in that liquor store. brain matter fly. (laughs) That's hilarious. I'm not going to lie. The first time I saw a Create Challenge video, I was like, I could do that shit. And then I got up up to go to the bathroom, and I tripped over my own shoe. (laughs) And Boy, I was I'm like, not even you know this what? Shit. I'm just going to sit my ass right back down. Like, last I, week you were going to ride a bull. This week yeah. you're going to do the milk crate yeah. challenge. I was like, I don't even need to pee no more. I just need to show up with shit in a camera yeah, for I now. Fell yeah. for I fell down doing things. no steps. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, you'd be the first motherfucker to fall forward because your dread's so heavy. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking around. No, one, st- one, you one strong oh, gust of wind, and it throws yeah. my entire equilibrium off, and <laughs> wham, I'm gone. Yeah. Uh, you could Ooh. do it. You take baths and meditate, so you probably could balance. You probably could probably. I think you could probably figure out of us four up here. I tell Jerry you, Jerry is done. No, no, <laughs> Jerry yeah. can't even get his truck good. <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you this I, much though. Yeah, they got a milkshake challenge. He's in. <laughs> yeah. <That's> like, <laughs> there you go. There I you tell go. you this much though, Trey. Okay. okay. I would have oh, the no. most viral fall ever. Oh yeah. Like my my fall would be <laughs> you, you got to see this motherfucker. Yeah. Oh yeah, they'd be mad at you no. cuz your dreads would catch and bring the whole damn pyramid down. The they whole pyramid would fall. The whole you you, you cheat, you brought your own side curtain airbags. Yeah. When I stand up there'd be a milk crate attached to one of my yeah, dreads absolutely. like and no. you somehow when you figure stand out a way. Up. <laughs> <laughs> and he'd somehow figure out a way to be naked. Somehow you would fall out of your clothes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I do it in a onesie. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's, uh, all right. Did you see his ass? Ian, you're uh you're getting some compliments in the chat on your uh, tattoos. Um oh, lots you. of ink there. Are you the uh, Jay Bird? You got your Jay Bird on your arm, uh on the hand. We know that. Uh what else is on you got other tattoos? Oh, me and Rachel's and <laughs> You you and the wifey there. What all do you you got you got some good work. That's good uh, stuff. Uh guitar coming out of my arm, uh hole in Hollywood tattoo, uh microphone. Wait, yeah. are you gonna cover that one up? No, I <laughs> well, you left. You ain't with them no more. I mean, like, 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 nah, you still made the music. Hey, you still bro, made the music. I, That's I just eternal. I slaved seven years of my life in that band. I under. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That'd be like a slave tattooing that, a noose to his neck. <laughs> 
Well, no. I mean, I love that white dude just there, you're not getting tattooed. Well, it's, it's, like, it's a reminder that I got to keep going no matter what. I feel Hell it. yeah to that. Yeah, like a slave tattoo with a ship on his arm. A ship or a but that's still, deal on his back. That's still mind. part of your fucking life. I gave my life to that dude, Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> Over with. No, it's Juneteenth, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <but> the, <laughs> I'm just saying, I gave him. <laughs> in fairness, the band paid him. It was. Ah, no, right. Fair enough. Fair enough. I, I, I digress. Slightly I wouldn't, different I wouldn't say that. Well, <laughs> but, <laughs> God, damn. It's a reason it's called Hold On, Hollywood. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got my money in. Hold up that money. Yeah, seven, seven day hold yeah. on Hollywood. That's uh, a. <laughs> 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 you uh, you want to play some music? What you want to do? You want to jam out? God. Let's uh, we got a good, oh. we got a good. Look at his face. He's like, I, I just want to leave. <laughs> I, just, I just want the fuck out of here. I don't want to sit by listen. this guy anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> we have not. Oh, this is this is a good house. I like this. We're in uh, we're in we're in good spirits. We got I'll tell you that. Good friends in the just studio. We over got here, uh. Bro. We got a uh, cheers. Jenny's got her uh, camera out, taking some pictures over there. You want a picture on set uh, while we're all doing it? Brian, come over here. Come, on, you Brian. come do us. Come get a sneak in. We already got everybody. Well, Jenny we, can get a we picture. We talk about y'all all the time, so you might as well get. You guys, have you guys ever been on the air with us one time, maybe? Uh, yeah. I think on the marathon, hours, right? Man. Come uh, on, come over here. Let me let's interview. Let's, the Whiskey Brothers Bar Show. Yeah. Let them get a look at you. Let's interview our fans. Brian competed. <laughs> There's 80 people in this fucking house right now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We're picking up the first two. Let them this, walk this, around. This shit's lasting for another 20 Jenny's hours. been a fan of ours for uh, Single file line, please. for so unbelievably long. Uh, Jenny painted the Slade Deadpool yeah. in the Sam Magneto. So so come around come around this side. Let's do this yeah, subtly. We'll on. let you share a microphone with Sam. Uh, I with love Sam. that you put the Whataburger yeah. fries in my Magneto, by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah. And they're floating. They, there's no metal in Whataburger fries, I would hope. And they're still floating. <laughs> Magnesium. She painted a uh, a Tim Burton like yeah, themed that? painting for me. That's oh yeah 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 yeah. You got a yeah, fantastic one too. It. She's uh, a remarkable and, artist. Uh, and, and Brian, say hi with your uh, baby dreads. <laughs> I just, I, I love it. I'm like, oh, you're Hello. you're so fucking cute. Hi. Oh God, these may be these may be you guys. How long have y'all been together now? I feel like so. How long have you? How long? How long? About a just a year. Oh shit! I thought y'all. All right, maybe y'all don't know each other as well as I think y'all do. That. No, no, we've actually known each other. Too. You've known each other. Oh, hang on a second. Okay. Hang you, on. You, let's put put him down. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm I'm quiz this shit. Do, there you go. Handle oh, that. Shit. Wait. Let's hang on. Let's 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 see. J hang on. I always I often fantasize about a a game show where you're with your spouse and you gotta guess shit. Uh huh. Bro, that would like be hilarious. The new, like the newlywed right game. Right before we go yeah. to the show, it'll be like, okay, look. <laughs> I don't know if you remember, but I like this. I like this. I like that. Yeah, yeah, remember yeah. Remember this shit. <laughs> if you're going on a game show. Right. But this ain't a game show. I just surprised them. Do so work. they haven't had any Cue prep the time. <laughs> 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 They've had zero prep time. Did you bring any stories? <laughs> go to uh, go to camera three. Let's do uh, let's do a quiz here. Let's do Jenny. It, ask. All right. Okay, hang on. Ask a question. All right. Ask Bryant something that he that you think he knows the answer to, and let's okay, see if he I was about right. to. Oh, you have a yeah. Go ahead. You have a question, have a question. that he, okay. that he will what's, know the answer to. What's, what's Jitty's favorite color? Okay. Ooh, um, she likes purple. Purple. Magenta, lots, lots of warm purple, colors. magenta, and warm colors. Is that correct? Uh, oh, all right, all right. We're going. We're going. That, that was an easy one. Okay. Go ahead, Slate. Um, Jenny, what's his favorite band? Tool. Tool is a strong answer. Uh, is it Tool? It's not Tool. Uh oh, this oh isn't no. gonna work. Alice in Chains. Alice in Chains. Oh, I like you. I like you. Like <laughs> Brand new like respect for Bryant. You're about to lose him. Right. Uh, All right. <laughs> 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 Brian, what's Jenny's favorite band? Um, she likes Hold On Hollywood. Hold On Hollywood. She's giving you a look right now, like if you don't get this, you're fucked. Oh, yeah. oh, it rhymes romance. with My Chemical Romance. Right. My Chemical Romance, obviously. Yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> and anything Michael Jackson. And anything Michael Jackson. That's strong. Yeah, fair. Uh, Who's Jenny's favorite comedian? <coughs> the Whiskey Brothers. There we go. We'll take a collection. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for this lady. Like, fuck you! I'll take the group. <laughs> um, What's up? Uh, 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 Jenny, what's Brian's favorite tattoo? Oh. Here, get in here. That he 
Get in it. Get on this microphone. Oh. Get on. Get on this microphone. Get on it. Don't Here, we can't hear you. Um, Let them hear you. Probably the three dragons that was inspired from Game of Thrones. The three dragons from Game of Thrones. Oh, I'm actually a lot bigger fan of the Remember Who You Are. Ooh. Oh shit. When you have so hey, many good so ones, should we stop this? <laughs> <laughs> so far, you guys have gotten no correct answers. No. Uh, uh, all right, f- you ask a question that he'll definitely know the answer to. Um, that, I'm not letting you guys leave here with no correct yeah, zero, answers. Yeah. What's my middle name? What's, what's her middle name? Elise. 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 <laughs> okay, oh, Brian, your turn. Mean, you you ask a, a question. A or or she'll e. know I hope she knows the answer. <laughs> oh my God. Jennifer Elise Ooh. Rodriguez. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you got to after you added oh your full man. name. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I bet you didn't expect that shit when you tuned in today, did you? <laughs> <laughs> come here, come here, come here. Oh, man. Oh, my man. Oh, my just God. think, Brian, 14 years, you look just like this. <laughs> hey, oh my God. Or in six years, you'll be having a ton of threes. No, it's all good. It's just buffering. We're all straight. The uh, Ian, you should play him something. Go all get your right, guitar. Really play shit. a song. Okay. Let's figure this out. You guys hang you tight. <laughs> Let Ian grab a guitar. There's no other way we would do this, man. I'm going uh, to jump up and give Ian a little room and see if I can straighten out the computer. That's up. absolutely perfect, brother. Uh, Ian is grabbing the guitar. Jenny, our dear friend uh, Rodriguez, yes, and our good friend Bryant. The soon-to-be-wed Jenny yes. Rodriguez. Yeah. That is, uh, look at that. You can hear her. <laughs> She feels like she's dreaming. You guys in the chat, I love oh seeing man. this. Uh, oh, it's, it's, if I it's know. a dream and I'm in it, it's a fucked up dream. The heat from this is reality. They say, hold the ring up, Jenny. They want to see they it. See that it. Is, uh, it is gorgeous. Yeah. Bling, bling. I'm zooming in right here. Yeah. There, uh, there we go. <laughs> Fucking awesome. Fucking awesome. Look at Fucking that. Awesome. <laughs> That's happy birthday, <laughs> motherfucker. What the fuck are you doing? And it's the white version. <laughs> All right, hold up. We getting this goddamn whiskey away from your ass. We'll put, uh, you can sing that one. Let that pick oh, up the guitar. All right. <laughs> this is why we have her. There it is. Oh, my bad, my bad. Can you hear it? We didn't do shit. Yeah. He did shit. <laughs> yeah, he did the best. You know who asked us? We we just fucking did what we mute do. Every, mute every mute everything. Mute the mics except for uh, green and yellow, and let uh, yeah, you could just set that on the table. It'll probably hold. Okay, we're gonna set it on the table. All right, time to suck. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> yes. What's up, man? I'm here for you. I'm trying. You over here watching. I can't do it when you're watching. I'm you shy. All right. All right. I'm out. You can turn me back on for a second. Turn. There we go. Yeah, we can hear you. This is uh, this is absolutely my favorite show that's ever happened. <laughs> hey, look, it was in the it was in the case, man. You know what I mean? It was outside. It was in the heat. Did you lead a band and they kicked you? Out? <laughs> <laughs> hey, if I didn't leave, it probably would have been shortly after. That's why it's called hold on. Hold on, I gotta leave right quick. <laughs> I gotta wait for Hollywood. <laughs> All right. Beauty queen of only 18 she had some trouble with herself she was always there to help them she always belonged to someone else 
I jump for miles and miles and wound up at your door. I had you so many times, but somehow I want more. I don't mind spinning every day out on the corner in the pouring rain. Look for a girl with a broken smile. Ask her if she wants to stay a while And she will be loved And she will be loved Tap on my window, knock on my door I wanna make you feel beautiful I know I tend to get so insecure doesn't matter anymore It's not always rainbows and butterflies It's compromise that moves us alone Yeah, my heart is full and my door's always open Come anytime you want, yeah I don't mind spinning every day Out on the corner in the pouring Look for a girl with a broken smile Ask her if she wants to stay a while And she will be loved And she will be loved And she will be loved And she will be I know where you hide Alone in your car No matter the things that make you who you are I know that goodbye means nothing at all Come back and catch her every time that she falls Yeah Tap on my window, knock on my door I wanna make you feel beautiful I don't mind spinning every day Out on the corner in the pouring rain, no Look for a girl with a broken smile Ask her if she wants to stay a while And she will be loved And she will Digitally throwing bras, they say. Uh, turn, uh, turn the rest of these mics on real quick, um, so we get. Hang on, you're not on. You're not even. You, 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 you put your headphones on. You'll hear yourself. Uh, Ian Dartes, uh, they're asking again. That is, uh, <laughs> that is our guest. He is in the podcast, uh, of course, serenading our good thank friends you, you, Jenny you. and Bryant. Your yeah, marriage proposal just cost us six hundred dollars of royalties. <laughs> 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 oh shit! So Congratulations, we love guys. you, but not that fucking much. <laughs> Congratulations a, to both of y'all, man. What a damn good episode. Uh, yeah. This makes me incredibly happy. Uh, Ian, come so sit hard. back. Go ahead. Anybody else dig hard? Yes. The, uh, <laughs> we, you won't believe what they're paying me. <laughs> this episode, <laughs> this episode has gotten away from us, but it is important that we mention vaultsoflore.com. 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 Yeah, Sponsors this marriage. Uh, we have... <laughs> <laughs> I just call you Volume One. Um, <laughs> the the book is uh, out. You can get it now. Ooh, it is a a, a tome, if you will. Uh, Jerry, you have finished it, and uh, you and I were talking about this earlier. Uh, it's called Vaults of Lore, Ajakaya Volume 1, Magic's End. You can get it on Shit. Amazon, or you can go to vaultsalore.com. Uh, that will take you over to the link. Yes. Pointing oh, pointing. That's perfect. Like we thought you had a pizza coming or something. <laughs> 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 yeah, I know your fat ass. Man. Oh, my God. <laughs> if you would have ordered a pizza right in the middle of his fucking proposal. <laughs> 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 
this motherfucker gave my damn house. I guess so, yeah, just like keep that. doing what you're doing. I gotta go get this fucking pizza. What the fuck, Trey? That's uh, uh, you should uh, you should definitely get the book. You should hang out and uh, read it along with us. I am about to start the journey myself. Uh, they will be on board. Lore. They will be on board for the month of September. So vaultoflore.com studios will continue for another month. Uh, we'll be able to talk about it. I'll have some things to speak of there. Uh, you guys don't have a copy. We're going to need to get you one. It was written by – now, Jerry, you've explained this to me. Vinford Sansbury, who is – uh, Vinford's basically the main character, and he's like this chicken bird creature from another – planet who has given these words to um, yeah, yeah, a human to, to, to michael our miller good friend who transcribed it so, so there's no black people in this book because he would have been on a plate these, mm. there's, yeah <laughs> actually actually there is <laughs> okay. well, one of the first people he meets in earth is yeah ah see <laughs> just knock the diversity right. right out yeah mm. get it right out of the way <laughs> <laughs> that's the <laughs> I mean, it's like the very first chapter. I meet a black dude, a Chinese guy, and it's they just get them all out of the Vaults way. Vaults of lowriders. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> then you never see them again for 18 chapters. It's Vaults of low main. It's Vaults of. <laughs> it's all the. They get them all out of the way right up front. <laughs> Holy. And a Norse guy, and it's Vaults of Loki. They do them all right up front. Uh, Vaults of lore .com. That's. That's our sponsor. Uh, what a spectacular episode. I wouldn't take this one back for all the money in the world. 947, the one where Jenny and Bryant got engaged. If we were naming them like Friends episodes, we're not. So it's going to be Machine named. Gun Sweaty. Classic. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I am sweaty. but uh, oh, na named in honor of our good friend Ian Dartes, formerly of Hold On Hollywood, now venturing off into a solo uh, endeavor, rebranding, if you will. So no longer Dizzy Moore even, huh? You're just going to no. do something totally different. Right. Pineapple based? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I'm always a pineapple king. Keys in a, uh, keys in a fish bowl huh right that's uh <laughs> ian Red mulch all of it no jerry uh, jerry wayne longmire <coughs> trey tuts and sam damaris uh the ones and twos threes and fours are jose pena and will loden uh and Your then of course guests. jenny dracaris and bryant high soon to be Man, sharing awesome. a uh, all kinds of things. I don't know what you're going to do with the names, but uh, we love you guys to death. I am Jenny High will be cool. cool so shit. it's uh, Jenny is high. <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> I'm so excited that you guys uh, did this here and uh, hang tight. We're going to do another episode. We we encourage you to join us. The rest of you on Twitch and everywhere else, please stick around. We're going to put 9:47 in the can, and uh, we will see you soon. They don't want no problem. Nah. Music provided by Scarface. Thank you for listening to yet another excellent episode of the Whiskey Brothers Podcast, the world's funniest podcast ever. The Whiskey Brothers Podcast was made in America by Americans, mostly in and around the Houston area. All content copyright the Whiskey Brothers. This concludes our broadcast day. Goodbye.